ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. Hey, what's going on, VIG? It's your boy, Die Hard. Um, wanted to talk about an issue within the community. Uh, before I get to that, I wanted to address something real quick. Uh, 2020 has been real harsh, rough, and ruthless. And we just got to stick together and try to get through it. From the whole coronavirus, COVID-19, uh, to the whole Black Lives Matter movement, we just got to stick together and try to get through this one. Uh, we're almost at the halfway point of 2020 to stick together and try to, you know, we'll use these video games as our scapegoat to get through this. You just got to pray and stick together, y'all. Um, an issue I wanted to talk about within the community was regarding uh, PlayStation. PlayStation 4, uh, was PlayStation 5 coming out the end of this year within the fall. Uh, PlayStation users as a whole within a very important gamers community. Uh, question that I always get asked, and I never had the chance to make it, you know, answer it or make a video on it until now. Um, hey, Di, how come PlayStation users always get left behind? Why we always get left for dead on upcoming uh, main event nights or Friday night game nights? How come we're never extended an invite to join and play? Um, the issue on that is just, uh, you know, most PlayStation users when you're most PlayStation users within this community, when they're playing on the PlayStation, they like to use their own ecosystem, meaning they have their own voice chat option readily available to them. And I think it's free too. Uh, they can do up to eight to 16 members in a party chat. And uh, when they have that option right there, ready at their fingertips with their controller, most PlayStation users don't want to use another device like their cell phone or uh, their computer to use voice communications to play with other people. Like they prefer to use it right there, readily available within their system. Um, like most of them don't want to have a cell phone running while they're playing a game and the headset's going with the cell phone moving over, you know, the, head, the headset wire going over to the cell phone, or most users don't have a PlayStation next to their PC, you know, to use the voice chat and play it on the PlayStation and have the computer on right next to them. I, I understand that. I get it. I get it. And um, that's what makes it so much harder within this community to have game nights or main event nights with playstation uses i mean there are times we do play games like rocket league or uh predator hunting grounds um you know games of cross play and it makes it kind of hard to play with somebody you can't communicate with um it's much more ease of use on like the nintendo switch or uh the xbox one or xbox one x because with the Nintendo Switch, it's portable. You can, you know, have it portable, have your cell phone right there on the table next to you, chop it up and kick it with your homies while you're playing on the Switch. Or you can take your Switch with you, sit next to your PC, you know, have the Switch portable and kick it and talk with your homies. Um, the Xbox One or Xbox One X, whichever one you're using, it's kind of easy on that one as well. Um, they have the voice chat option from xbox live to windows 10 users where they can communicate and talk with each other um which is understandable so that's why it makes it easier for us to communicate with other platform users um it is it is what it is and, and i'm trying and i'm open to ideas on how to change that i'm open to your opinions on how to change that how can we implant implement PlayStation users within our game nights in this community and very important gamers. I'm open to ideas. I'm open to opinions. You shoot them out to me or any of the other admins or to any of the other counselors 
on how we can do that. Um, Cause we want you guys a part of this community. Uh, you know, you shouldn't be, you know, not be able to participate because of the platform of your choice that you play on. Um, it is starting to change more often now because you are starting to see a lot more games with the crossplay feature. Uh, games like, uh, I don't know, NBA Playgrounds 2. Uh, what else? There's uh, Call of Duty Modern Warfare. Like a lot of these games are offering the crossplay feature and we should be taking advantage of it more often. Um, hopefully, you know, games like Destiny will get it. Uh, the Division will get it. And it'll allow us to play together. Um, so once again, I, I am open to ideas. You got any ideas, just shoot it out to me or shoot it to any to other admins, or any other, other counselors. Um, other than that, that's just something I wanted to uh, get on and, and, and actually you know, answer that question. It's been sitting for a while just to answer that. Um, other than that, all you guys, I want you to, you know, stay safe, keep gaming, and, and God bless you all. Take care.